Infinity Two family, welcome back to the channel. T Infinity Two, T Infinity here, back again with another message for you. So this, wow, there's a tower about to take place. I don't know if this is for divine feminine or divine masculine or the karmics. I feel like it is for the karmics, but I feel like divine feminine and divine masculine, you are going to witness this. Like this is going to be something that takes place right before your eyes. So, if you're new to the channel, thank you for being here. Thank you for tuning in. If you hear something in the background, that once again, that is my nephew. Okay? Don't pay him no mind. Just focus what I'm saying. Okay? It's not going to resonate with everybody. But if it resonates with you, hit that thumbs up. Hit that bell. And subscribe. Let me show you your energy that you're in right now. Do y'all see that? Do y'all see that energy? Feast. Feast. It says, slow down and celebrate yourself. Yes. So you on your throne. You on your throne. That's what I'm seeing here. You on your throne. And because you on your throne, it's time for you to chill out. <laughs> That's what I'm seeing here. It's time for you to chill out and take a break. It's time for you to celebrate yourself, okay? And then, what did, what did I say? What does that say, y'all? Put it in the comment section below. Tower. Tower. Unplug and relax for a spell. Three. So, I'm here by the power of three times three. A lot of you could say that. Um, I'm also seeing here... You have been eating and drinking very healthy. If you look back here, though, it's like cobwebs. It's like cobwebs. And it seems like somebody is trying to get you into their web. Like, somebody is trying to get you into their web. They don't want you to... They don't want you to be fresh. They don't want you to be clean. They don't want you to be you know in your energy it says you've earned all your stripes you've earned all your stripes okay so how is that for happily ever after so you see how it's a whole bunch of smoke around this um behind it says once upon a time too if you look in that book it says once upon a time so one Welcome back to the channel, T Infinity 2, T Infinity here back again with another message for you. So, today we're going to be taking a look into Divine Feminine and Divine Masculine Energy and we're going to see what the Most High and the Archangels have for us and Mother Earth have for us today. Alright, take what resonates and leave what doesn't. I'm just going to get a little Palo Santo going in here, okay? If you're new to the channel, thank you for being here. Thank you for tuning in. This is general. It's not going to resonate with everybody, but if it resonates with you, hit that thumbs up, hit that bell, <clears> throat> throat> throw chakra, and be sure to subscribe, okay? Shout out to my great-grandfather. Today is his birthday. He is a Leo, and he was a twin. So I just want to shout out him. Yes, twins do run in my family. And um, my grandfather actually was a twin, and today is his birthday. So I just want to give a special shout out to my grandfather and my uncle Wilton. Shout out to y'all! I love y'all, and thank you for always guiding me and always being there for me as well in the spiritual realm and in the physical realm. So, um, divine feminine, divine masculine. Earlier, I had did a reading. And um, I had gotten that reading some about drama for the top of the week. So today is clearly Sunday. Tomorrow is Monday. And this was supposed to be taking place on Tuesday. I don't, I'm not sure, you know, because, you know, energy is fluid. So it could, it could be today, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. I'm not very sure exactly, exactly when it's going to happen. But we're going to tap into this energy right now and we're going to see what exactly is going on here all right because um that that message was it said yes success so you, either way you're going to be successful 
So um, this could be dealing with someone, somebody that's married, or you could be married, or you could be separated, or you could be getting a divorce. Choose words carefully, okay? Choose words carefully, 222 on this clock. So I'm really, like, getting here. Like, I'm really getting, like, somebody is trying to say negative things on your life like speak negativity onto your life okay that's what i'm getting here and somebody could be doing actual curses i'm getting here curses like trying to curse you or trying to put curses over your bloodline that's what i'm hearing here okay so this is where some of the drama could come from somebody could also be wanting to argue with you this could be somebody that you were separated from look but they're gonna want to contact you but the way that you're going you, the way that you alchemize the situation is what i'm hearing here is going to be so like amazing okay because somebody is under mk ultra mind control programming that's what i'm saying here and they are going to want to argue with you or they're going to want to start a conflict with you because they don't see things the way that you see things they don't perceive things the way that you perceive things but you're persevering that's what i'm saying here so let's get the first energy for divine feminine holy spirit from the cue card deck Ruach Akodesh. Thank you. Twist of fate. Twist of fate. Do you see this? So, Divine Feminine, you are experiencing a twist of, like, you're experiencing something that was supposed to be being prevented from you, Divine Feminine. Yeah, because you were being targeted. You were being targeted and you could still be feeling this energy come the Lion's Gate portal. That's what I'm hearing here, okay? You could still be feeling this energy comes the line come the Lion Gate portal. Go take a look at my other message that I just did. Go take a this is on the title page. This is on the title picture of it. The thumbnail? Yeah. This is on that. Go take a look at that. You are you are still trying you are still being targeted or somebody is still trying to target you. Okay, that's what I'm seeing here. Let me see the uh, energy of divine masculine. Didn't I just show y'all that? Holy Spirit said, this is divine masculine. Somebody, divine masculine is hurt over a marriage. Somebody divine masculine wants to give them a ring, ring, ring. Do y'all see this? It says ring, ring, ring. Somebody divine masculine is feeling very traumatic <clears throat> right now. Like they're feeling like dramatic. I'm also hearing here. Somebody here also has childhood traumas that they still have yet to heal. But they want to mend a relationship with you. If you look at this, it says mend a relationship. Okay, I could never make this up. They want to call you to mend a relationship with you. <clears throat> After they've been targeting you, okay? After they've been targeting you with hella negative energy. That's what I'm hearing here. After the, See? Call you. They want to call you. After they've been targeting you with hella negative energy. Okay, let's get one more for divine feminine twist of fate why you show us this thank you yeah because they want a chance with you they still want a chance with you that's why they're putting curses and shit over you or trying to but you're protected but they're trying to argue with you as well that's what i'm seeing here they know that there's a, a there's a possibility that they will never have a chance with you again but they're saying now they're willing to go 50-50 with you, Divine Feminine. That's a fact of life. They want to talk about the birds and the bees. That's what I'm hearing too. Y'all know what that means. Okay, so yeah, we're going to take this 50-50 here. You walked away from this person and, the, and you took your power back. That's what I'm hearing here. All right, so let's get one from the shapeshifter. Let's get one from the shapeshifter for Divine Feminine and Divine Masculine. When it comes to this dramatic situation or this drama, I'm already seeing here one and um, 29. So three, three could be significant to somebody. Somebody could be born in March or somebody could um, have three children or somebody could be born on the third of a month. 
That's what I'm saying here. Or somebody could be, um, somebody could have a child that's three. Somebody could also be in their 30s. I'm hearing that too. Somebody could also be in their 30s that this message is for. Why did you show me this for Divine Feminine, please? The dice with the 50-50. Number 24, the delicate fairy and her favorites. Change is natural and good. And yes, it can hurt. So Divine Feminine, you changed you changed and by you changing this hurt this person by you changing divine feminine this hurt this person you could have changed when you turned 24 years old you can be 24 okay something changed in april okay i'm hearing that as well yeah number 23 could be significant to somebody number 23 it says the time has come the time is the time to act is now so if somebody know that the time is now. That's why they're trying to target you, Divine Feminine. That's what I'm seeing here. Somebody knows that the time is now. And it's a time to say goodbye. And I feel like you know that and you are saying goodbye to someone. But somebody else is not saying goodbye to you. Somebody does not want to let something go or let something end or let something be. Somebody wants to continue on until a tragedy that's what i'm hearing here okay i'm dead ass hearing that somebody wants to um to a tragedy i'm here until death do you part i'm dead ass hearing that okay so somebody does not want to end something and unless it's ending in a tragedy what why are you showing me this for divine masculine ring 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 with men in relationship when it comes to this because um number 13 number this is number no this is number 15 your imaginary friend childhood treasures resurface so like i said somebody still has not healed their childhood trauma somebody still has yet to do that this masculine and yeah you see that and they know that you see that fiona and the unicorn the gift of sacred sight this came out before when i said one plus 29 is 30 this is the one that had came out Okay, so Divine Masculine, you know that somebody has to give the sacred sight. This person could have been trying to help you. That's what I'm hearing here. Yeah, they have been trying to uplift you. Hedgehog, hedgehog love. Hedgehog love. Positive uplifting new friends, number 10. Okay, this could have been going on for 10 years. Or you could have a child that's 10 years old. Or you could be born in October. But I'm really seeing here 1010 on this clock right now as I'm seeing this. Something is definitely over with that you need to let go of. That's what I'm seeing here. You need to let go of this year. You need to move on. A time to say goodbye. A time to say goodbye, Divine Masculine. That's what I'm seeing here with this hedgehog love. You, um, Somebody was here to uplift you. And... um. I feel like they did what they had to do for you. And now it's time for you to do what you have to do for you. Yeah, look, 888. Didn't I say come this Lion Gate portal, y'all? Trying to tell you, come this Lion Gate portal. This is what's taking place, okay? This is exactly what's taking place. So, Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, can you please clarify the, this for Divine Feminine? Clarify this, the a uh, twist and fate. Tuesday. This energy is coming out again. Go take a look at my video that I just did before this video. This is coming out again. Somebody is doing a freezer spell. A freezer spell, okay? They are doing a freezer spell on your higher self, Divine Feminine. That's what I'm seeing here. Tuesday, Martha is actually popped, okay? What else? This is really taking place on Tuesday. So go take a look at my video because it said Tuesday. And that's about the drama that they want to... Um, they want to transpire. Somebody is a dog walker. I just said that. So somebody could have a dog or somebody could walk a dog for somebody else. Uh, let me see this energy for divine masculine Holy Spirit when it comes to the ring, ring, ring. a wholesome woman so divine masculine you want to contact a wholesome woman okay you could have been married to this person or you could have been 
um, engaged to this person. Okay, but I'm seeing here you want to contact this person here. You want to contact this person, wholesome woman here. Yeah, this person is spiritual. This person is spiritual, divine masculine, or you could be spiritual, okay? You're, you're getting tarot readings on this person, divine masculine, or they're getting tarot readings on you. But I feel like you're getting tarot readings on this person. This could be the divine feminine. Mm-hmm. Because something is mundane. Something is just like same day, different sh I mean, diff y'all know what I mean. Different day, same shit. Somebody feels like that, yo. Like, word up. They do. Okay, Holy Spirit, can you clarify this, please? 50 50 for Divine Feminine. Why you show us this? Something is very messy. I saw a stolen property, and somebody is a succubus energy. Somebody is a succubus energy. A text men while sleep so divine feminine somebody knows that they're with somebody that is a succubus ener energy somebody also knows somebody that is giving that is giving them a dirty offer this is a succubus energy i don't feel like they want this i don't or this could be you yeah because they know you are a psychic truth teller they know you a psychic truth teller divine feminine and something is very messy Okay, that's why they want to go half with you. 50-50, I'm seeing that. They want to go half with you in a relationship. Yeah, because somebody also stole it property. Somebody stole some property. Mm -hmm. They look at you as a soulmate relationship, Devon Feminine. So sh tell us about um, this ring, 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 which is wholesome woman when it comes to Devon Masculine. I'm getting ready to put some tarot. Look, what I told y'all, they said I can sense you. And you can sense this person. I'm I feel it like you who are watching this video, Infinity Two Family, you can you can sense this person. Cause you're a psychic truth teller. They know this. They know this. And this is exactly what I said in my other video. This is exactly what I said. This is the same type of energy, but it's not the exact same, but it's kind of the same. Look, they know somebody fake as fuck now. 1444 on this clock. Divine Masculine knows that somebody else is fake as fuck that they around right now. It really hurt me when you left. It really hurt me when you left. So, this person that left you, it could have really hurt you. Okay? This person could may not have thought that or may not have felt like you even cared. But deep down inside, this really hurt you when they left you. Or... You could have hurt them when you left them. Take it how it resonate, okay? You know who you are in this reading. Because this was your match. Or now they have met they match. Now, whoever whoever got hurt by somebody leaving them, that person met they match. So if you was the person that left somebody, that person you left, they already found they match now. You're late. Now, if you are the person that got left, this person that left you, you found your match, and they know you found your match. And they are hurt behind this. They are hurt, okay? That's what I'm seeing here. If you was the person that left, you hurt behind this. We wish you never left this person, okay? That's what I'm seeing here. So we're going to go ahead and, yeah, because this was your life partner. I'm hearing just keep calm. I'm seeing just keep calm. So just keep calm, okay? That's what I'm seeing here. Yeah, just keep calm. This is not nothing to get all riled up and upset about. It is what it is. I'm hearing here, okay? It is what it is. So, we're going to go ahead and clarify each and every single one of these. Especially when it comes to divine feminine and divine masculine and the succubus energy and all these things like this. All right? Succubus energy. Look, it's a conflict. This is the same energy that was coming out, I promise you. Secrets is coming out. It's creating a conflict because somebody is noticing that somebody is not who they say they are. They are succubus energy. And Divine Feminine, you could have told somebody that somebody they was with somebody that's a succubus energy. Divine Masculine, you're noticing that you need to heal from your childhood trauma. And you also noticing that somebody that you was married to, divorced from, or that you were engaged to, 
you want a men in a relationship with and it's a conflict it's becoming a conflict this is an inner conflict you could be a pisces cancer scorpio or you could be an aries leo sad but this is definitely becoming an inner conflict this is becoming an inner conflict yeah look and this is causing somebody to be enraged like this is causing somebody to really be dramatic wanting to fight wanting to argue wanting to really like hurt somebody that's what i'm seeing here yeah this this nine of pentacles this person who's single abundant independent and very i'm hearing um um very self-sufficient this person is introverted as well this person is a person that stays in the house a lot this person don't really deal with a lot of people this person is very to themselves and this masculine knows that this masculine knows that for a fact and i feel like somebody has had a powerful realization about this third party situation that this masculine is in okay that's what i'm seeing here you could be a virgo that i'm talking to or you could be in a situation with a virgo but we getting ready to clarify y'all I hope that y'all enjoying this message. If you do, hit that thumbs up, hit that bell, comment below. If you feel like you're dealing with a sucky bitch energy, because that's a guarantee. That's a guarantee. 1818 on this clock. Divine Feminine. This person wants to fight with you, the succubus energy. Tell us about the twist of fate when it comes to the succubus energy in this five of wands. Why is it such a conflict? Why is it such a competition? Because you are independent, single, and abundant, Divine Feminine. And you cut somebody off and you left them cut off. That's why. That's why this person want to fight you. Yeah, and you following your destiny. Or that's why this person is in competition with you. And because you know that they're a succubus energy. That's what I'm seeing here. You could have been giving somebody a side eye or somebody could have been giving you a side eye. It's say that you're a priestess here. Okay, somebody knows that you're a priestess for sure, for sure. Somebody knows that you are a high priestess or a priest. That's what I'm seeing here. Somebody also know that you done changed. Clarify this nine of pentacles with this five of wands here. Yeah, somebody know that you changed. And they know that you're not immature. But this person is. And the Holy Spirit, Heavenly Father is watching this person be very immature. Trying to cause the problem with you. Trying to cause drama with you. Straight up. That's what I'm seeing here. Yeah, that is a guarantee. The shit is exposed to you. You've been enlightened about it. Come this Leo season. Okay? Tuesday, it looked like. Or Tuesday, your ancestors say, get that shit up out of here. You're protected. Seven of Wands. Tell us about this uh, divine masculine when it comes to this situation with the ring, ring, ring and the wholesome woman. This person sees you victorious and successful. This person sees that you um, are getting recognition. This person also sees you put your ego to the side. Now, they want to do the same thing. They, that's very attractive, attracted to them, attractive to them. That's what I'm hearing here. That's a guarantee. <laughs> Cannot. That's a guarantee. Straight up. And now somebody feels like they're being left as an option because somebody wants to give and take with you. Two, three, four on this clock. You may have been seeing two, three, four. If that if you have this message is for you, that's a sign. Okay? This person wants to give and take with you equally. This first that's two sixes, y'all done saw. This part six of pentacles with the six of wands. This person knows that they can build with you. That's what I'm seeing here. And somebody is steadily spying on this. Clarify this uh, wholesome woman, Holy Spirit, when it comes to divine masculine. Somebody do not want you to go to this person or somebody does not want you to look at this person as a wholesome woman. They want you to look at this person as um, unemotionally available. That's what I'm seeing here. Yeah. Yeah. But you're mentally imprisoned about this and you turning your back on somebody divine masculine and it look like to follow your destiny. Yeah, this childish person, this princess of pentacles, go look at my other video. This part, this energy keep coming out. Tell us about the princess of cups when it comes to the truth, tell the Holy Spirit. Cause this is a person that don't tell the truth, that you with divine masculine. That's what I'm hearing here. But you know somebody that speaks the truth, the whole truth, and nothing but the truth. Yeah, and that's why you look like this. Eight of Cups. You disappointed because you picked a liar, Divine Masculine. I can never make it up. Look what pop. The Emperor. 
You pick somebody that's a liar. This person looks at you as a liar too. That's what I'm seeing here. They look at you as immature, divine, masculine. So what is the outcome? What is the outcome? Um what is the outcome for divine feminine and divine masculine when it comes to this dramatic situation, Holy Spirit? Queen of Pentacles. Queen of Pentacles. So I'm, this is either somebody's mother or this could be you or this could this could be a child's mother. But I feel like this is divine feminine and I feel like you getting your wishes fulfilled. That's the outcome. What is the outcome for uh, this emperor here when it comes to this? The truth has been exposed. The truth has been exposed. I already showed y'all the sun card. The truth has been exposed to this masculine about the destiny. Okay? About this destiny. Yeah, and they are broken hearted about it. Three of swords to the eight of swords. And they turning their back on somebody so they can move forward. That's what I'm seeing here. Mm hmm To the happiness. The sun card. And I just called it out. So I hope that this message resonated with you. This is what all the drama is about. Because somebody is having a powerful realization that somebody is not who they say they are. That princess of pentacles. They trying to say that they are queen of pentacles. But they are not. Okay. And this is the masculine coming out of. I'm hearing spell work. They are coming out of their delusional state. And they are recognizing the truth. The whole truth. And nothing but the truth. So this is what's taking place. For Divine Feminine and Divine Masculine, we're going to pull some angel answers and we're going to get up on out of here. The truth has been revealed. That's what I'm seeing here. Compromise. Compromise I'm seeing here. Compromise. Because justice is going to be served. Remain positive, Divine Feminine. Remain positive. And for Divine Masculine... The situation will improve. They go that water again. So, Divine Masculine, you can be in your feelings right now, but the situation will improve. I hope that y'all enjoyed this, this message. Ask others for help, and I will see you in my new video. Peace.